गुड मॉर्निंग एवरी वन एंड वेलकम टू योर इंग्लिश वर्चुअल क्लास दिस इज द कवर पेज ऑफ योर इंग्लिश रीडर बुक एंड ऑन पेज नंबर वन यू कैन फाइंड अ हेडिंग ग्रोइंग अप यू कैन सी देर इज अ कार्टून इन दिस पिक्चर एंड इट इज रिटर्न इंट्रोडक्शन वेन यू विल रीड दिस कार्टून यू विल फाइंड द आंसर that why teachers get headache and so this is the light introduction of your book we will start with the topic on page 3 on page 3 there is a story monday morning blues it is a story of a little boy tom how he feel on monday morning so what does the title here means in the title there is a word blues it means feeling sad so what do you feel when sunday gets over and you have to go to school the next day you may feel lazy tired or you may don't want to go to school just like the boy tom in the story this story is an extract from mark twain greatest word the adventure of tom sawyer mark twain was one of the greatest author in american literature tom aunt polly sid and mary are the main characters of this story this whole story revolves around them before reading the chapter let me tell you all the summary of this chapter This is a story of a boy called Tom who lives with his aunt whose name is Aunt Polly and his cousin Sid. One Monday morning Tom was very unhappy. You know why he was very unhappy? Because the weekend is over and he did not want to go to school. He lies in bed thinking that it would be nice to stay home. because he always try to get way to avoid the routine he lies in bed thinking that it would better to stay at home he feels hopeful about the pain from a loose tooth but then he realized that his aunt polly will pull it out if he will complain her about this then he suddenly remember that he has a sore toe tom lies in bed holding his toe and start producing various sounds showing that he is in very much pain his cousin sid he was sleeping beside him he shakes him make him awake he begs it not to tell aunt polly that he is unwell this frightened sid he ran downstairs to aunt polly and told her that tom is going to die aunt polly rushes towards tom's room to check what is the matter when she reached there she realized that it is only an overacting done by tom why to avoid school she laughs tom felt foolish at his act but he knew that he was caught then he said that i am also worried about my tooth it is aching too much aunt polly check his tooth and told mary to get a silk thread and a chunk of fire why because to pull out the aching tooth tom got frightened and said please don't aunt please I don't want to stay at home from school. I have done this to avoid my school. Now the whole situation was clear to Aunt Polly now. After all the tantrums Aunt Polly pulled out his teeth and all the efforts done by Tom got in vague. So here the story ends. Now tell me what is the moral of the story? The moral of the story is don't tell a lie in front of your parents elders because 
दे आर वेरी मच एक्सपीरियंस एंड वाइजर देन यू सो इन योर होमवर्क यू विल रीड द स्टोरी गिवन ऑन पेज नंबर थ्री पेज नंबर फोर एंड पेज नंबर फाइव टमोरो वी विल कॉन्टिन्यू विद नोटबुक वर्क एंड द बुक एक्सरसाइजेज ऑफ द चैप्टर of your english reader book bye for now take care and thank you